Louis and B.B. Barron created the first all-electronic film score in 1956 for the movie The Forbidden Planet. Originally, when they first created this movie, uh, the score for the movie, they were only supposed to do a short piece for it. And after they played it for the director, the director decided he liked it so much that he wanted them to do the entire score. Um, this is the monster that appears during this particular song from the score. Uh, you can go ahead and listen to that for a second. When this movie first came out, people were very startled to hear these kinds of noise coming from the movie. You know, it wasn't something they had ever really heard before. Um, many uh, people now who are grown up, who watch this as children, say how terrified they were during this scene uh, because of the sound effects. Um, others, when they talked to Bibi and Louise after the showing said that it sounded how they imagined things while they were dreaming. Um, mainly when they were recording, they used vacuum tubes as well as recitators, capillators, and reverberations, which they had to create making their own of, because uh, the technology wasn't readily available, so they had to make their own at that point. And uh, these were mainly done by Louise. He kind of made all of their circuits and everything. Um, the score was a huge hit, and it prompted many other movies to then start using this type of music in their uh, productions. Um, unfortunately, they were never acknowledged as musicians, so they weren't actually ever able to receive any awards for this in the for the Academy Awards. Um, but that is Louise Barron and Louise and BB Barron and their score of the Forbidden Planet.